Hi there everybody, I'm Lynn Montoya and this is a 30 day stretch challenge that I put together for me and my clients um, that I want to share with you and if you're my client, hi there. Uh, so we're going to do uh, six stretches on each side, um, a pike and then the actual split. Um, for some of you it might be better to think of it as just a flexibility routine and not so much like it's got to be about the split. It's more about just um, learning how to stretch daily and seeing if there are any benefits to stretching. Um, because I kind of suspect there is. I don't stretch a lot. I, and it's bad because <laughs> I've, I've been working out since I was 15 and I probably stretched 45 <laughs> minutes total in those 35 years. <laughs> so. Luckily, I'm somewhat flexible, and there are some people that are more flexible, that it's called being hyper-flexible, that are more flexible than others. All right, so here, is, you're gonna do the routine with me real real time. I've got my timer, uh, so you'll need a interval timer, set it to 45 seconds with a, oh, with a five minute, or I'm sorry, a, a five second break in between, and which means I need to change this real quick. Hold on, and then some music. Uh, of course, that's that's optional. Um, I wonder if I can cut all this part out because this has got to be really boring for you. All right, interval time timer set for 45 seconds on, five seconds off, and that'll give you enough time to get into the um, next pose. You want to hold the pose. Like 45 seconds, but um, you're going to notice as we do this that every day is going to be a little bit different. Some days you're going to be tighter, even like two weeks into it, um, and just go with it. Never, ever, ever force it. Um, it's like putting a, a round peg in a square hole. Just don't force it. Relax, breathe, like take a deep breath in and exhale it. And I'll talk about that all in a second. Okay, the first one is gonna be a low lunge. We're gonna do everything on the right side and then do it on our left side. So, nice long legs. You're gonna push your hips forward. And let's do it. Here we go, so push your hips forward. You really want to, you're gonna feel it here and on this quad. But what that's doing is, is allowing you to open up the hips. Put my music on. I love music. Uh, okay, we got the art of minimal techno. Go back to my timer. Sorry, I'm not being rude and being on my phone. I was making the magic happen. All right, almost. Push it down a little bit more. Ah, feel it stretch your hip flexor. This is a really good stretch for those people that sit all day, which is most of us. Okay, now you're gonna shift it back. Curl your toe under, shift it back. Think about your butt reaching away from your body. Feel the, the pull in your hamstring, toe up. Now, you might be like this, but I want you to cough, cough, actively think um, with you know over the next couple of weeks that you're you're always trying to get it down lower so what some people do me included is I'll just go down and then sit but that's not active stretching you got to think about it so so see if I just relax into it you see how much further I can go but you you just have to let it happen all right, next one, I'm gonna go into pigeon. You're gonna pull your foot in front of you, making it, uh, oh, I'm horrible in geometry. Right angle. All right, so if you need, and then you're gonna twist your hips. And see, when you do that, when you think about bringing this hip down to the ground, you really feel it in your glute. And stretching that big ass, literally, <laughs> muscle, well not that it's big, but this muscle feels so good. 
So, stay here if you need to, or bring it all the way down. Oh, can you see me? I'm hiding. Bring it all the way down. Now we're going to go into a side straddle. Spread it as wide as you can. That's what he said. And over to your right side, bend over. Now you can do it like this. You can do it like this. You can do it like this. But just be the stretch. Don't go through the motion. Don't sit here and be like, what am I eating for dinner tonight? Um, because you're not, then you're not doing what you're supposed to be doing, which is stretching. So if you're gonna stretch, stretch. <laughs> so wherever you're at, do that. All right, next is the hamstring stretch. I forgot my little, you can get a belt or something or you can hold on to your toe. But you want your back flat, your shoulders flattened down on the ground. Don't be like this. Nice and flat. Pull. Oh my God, it hurts so bad. <laughs> and, and some stretches are gonna hurt for you and some aren't. Um, this one hurts for me. I feel it all the way in my calves, odd up. Um, yeah, me no like <laughs> But sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. So just hold that. And the next, you're gonna sit up. Look, I'm gonna do it gracefully. Sit up, legs forward. Inhale, bring it down as far as you can go. Again, that's what he said. <laughs> um, oh, here's a good idea. Try, when you do this, keep your shoulders rolled back. Well, now, you can roll them a little bit, but don't round your back too much. If you round your back, you're making it a rounded back exercise, and it's a stretch here so keep think about keeping your back flat like somebody's literally pushing you down left side should i do do it this way no i need to be on the side Low, oh wrong way what is that right no this way <laughs> you got it you, you're you're way ahead of me Okay, low lunge again, stretching that hip flexor. I'm talking to you, Jamila. Stretch it. So how was your day? Yeah. Oh, wow. That's good. Hey, you know what I did today? I had a salad for breakfast and it was fantastic. And shift it back. I really think that if you start the day with a nice healthy salad, how can you have a bad day? Like with all the pretty colors of the rainbow, all those phytonutrients. Oh, again, think about but going back. Feel it. Toes curled under. Toes up. Now now do this. You see how when you play around with your body, <laughs> not in the bedroom, but <laughs> when you feel, when you do this, do you feel it more now in your, your calf? So don't pull it too high, I guess is the motto of that story. Okay, pigeon. Curl and twist. Sit upright. Bring it on down if you can. You can't see me. So this is okay, too. This is okay. Just do what you can.
So we started out doing this at 30 seconds or a, um, with the option of doing it a minute or two times a day, but I don't think that that's really effect effective. So side straddle. Um, that's why I'm changing it once a day. You want to do more, 30 points, but you're going to do it um, once a day for 45 seconds. Yes, it is a commitment. But your body, you have to commit to your body. You have to continuously work on it. So, why not? <laughs> Oh, again, I just noticed I wasn't really going into the stretch. Ah, see? Ah, oh, Jesus. All right, and then hamstring stretch. It's a little harder for me because I'm talking to you guys and I'm trying to entertain you as well. Um, so that's why I keep forgetting. But you're on your own right now and your job, your focus, is to stretch. So do what I say, <laughs> not what I do. You can bring your head up, pull it more. Really open it up, like feel it. Okay, now we have our pike. Oh, we already did that one. Okay, never mind the pike. No, let's do the pike. And I'll write this down. Or I'll put it in the um, comments. Or whatever it is that you do on YouTube. This is my first one, so. If it's too, if it's too long you can, and you need an extra 45 seconds, Take this pike out. That's it. Keep the back flat. Tailbone reaching away like you're being pushed down on the ground. Xenia is staring at the door at me. I had to shut it because she was just standing there in front of the video screen like boo. So she stared a hole through me. All right, let's do our split. Here we go. Red side. Not bad. I'm getting there. Look at that. I'm 50 years old and can almost do a split. <laughs> so, oh, yes. So, thank you, um, um, my uh, gals from St. Joe's. So when you, this is the most important exercise out of all these exercises. If you're in a really pinch and you know you need to stretch, but you seriously only have 10 minutes or, or five minutes or whatever, do that. Doing the split is what is honestly what's gonna get you to do the split. So, you see on this side, I'm not as, um, I can't go down as much. So if that's the case, you can do, here are some options. You can um, get yoga blocks or pillows and put them down like this. If you can get a little bit lower, you can put it down like this. Ah, see, look at that. And just, and, and hold it. Oh my God. It hurts, but honestly, it feels good. All right, that's a wrap. And gosh darn it, if I didn't do it again, <laughs> we need to warm up first. <laughs> Sorry, I was running around getting everything ready. So a few more, and I'll put this wherever I need to put it to let you know. Um, to warm up, oh, oh, now you can't see me. Um, do, this is your warm up. I want you to do 10 jumping jacks. One, two, three, four, well you know how to count. And then I want you to do um, 10 uh, kick ups. And that's gonna get your blood flowing 
and um, start stretching out the legs. So, sorry about that. I'll get better as time goes by. Um, like I said, this is the first uh, real uh, video I'm making. So, thank you um, so much for wanting to listen, wanting to learn, wanting to um, and work on your body. Because if you don't work on your body, who else will? It's your job, it's your responsibility. It doesn't matter if you have time or no time or, or whatever, you have to make it happen. And if you need help with that, please contact me. Um, we'll just chat, I'm not trying to get new clients, I've got plenty of clients, um, but I do really, really want to help. So if you have a problem, please go to my website, Lynn Montoya Fitness, and uh, contact me and let me know. Dudes, do not send me dick pics or ask me to show a picture of a body part. Not going to happen. Okay? Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.